Hello, I'm Rosario Tanasio, Applications Manager from ST Microelectronics. Welcome to our booth at APEC 2016, where we are showcasing our cutting edge products, including our USB power delivery solution, which uses an STM32. As you may know, USB power delivery is the latest USB standard. It uh, can be used to uh, deliver power to multiple devices uh, and uh, uh, it minimizes uh, confusion for the end user about uh, uh, cable and uh, plug uh, orientation thanks to the use of the new Type-C connector. It can uh, be also used in alternate mode and transfer data between a device and an host with very high speed. More specifically, USB power delivery can be used up to 100 watts and can transfer data with a rate that is as high as 10 gigabit per second. Our demo here today shows a typical use case with a provider and two different types of consumer that can be charged from the same board. In the provider side, we have two separate boards, a power board and a control board. The power board is implemented with our new STCH02 controller with quasi-resonant operation. Uh, together with our high voltage MOSFETs and power shock diodes, uh, it can implement a highly efficient flyback converter with uh, multiple output voltage, low standby losses uh, and a current capability up to 3 amps. On the other side, we have uh, the provider board which uses an STM32F0 nuclear board coupled with an expansion board which is used for Type-C interface. So here you can see the two Type-C ports. So for uh, the purpose of our demo today what we want to show is the charging of two different uh, devices, a laptop and a mobile phone. They are both ready to communicate and the communication will uh, initiate as soon as uh, the cable is connected from one end to the other. Okay, let's take a look and see how it works. We can take uh, the Type-C cable and uh, connect it to the Type-C port uh, of uh, uh, this uh, laptop. Once we connect the Type-C cable to the laptop, the battery will start to charge. The provider and the consumer will start negotiating power, and in particular the consumer will request a certain amount of power to the, to the provider. The provider will switch its output voltage, which previously was set at 5 volts to 12 volts, and a successful power contract is established between the two parts. This is shown on the nuclear board by the LED changing color. Um, a similar thing can be done using a different type of consumer, in this case a mobile phone. If we connect the mobile phone to the Type-C connector, what will happen in this case is a different power contract will be established. The consumer will request 5 volts and 3 amps of current to the provider and the mobile phone will be, will be charged twice as fast compared to standard USB devices. Thank you very much for your interest and attention. For further information, please visit ST.com.